Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Crawl Let's Play. <clears throat> so last time we didn't die, apparently. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. We didn't die. Okay. Uh, hello, orcs. I'd like to kill your wizard before anything else, because they're more dangerous, I think. Are you coming? Okay, you can just wait there. Yeah, the wizard. I'm happy we haven't come across any like huge groups of those, actually. I don't think we have anyway. Uh, bat skeleton just got one-shotted. Okay. Not particularly good skeleton. I have five of those. What the fuck? It must be removed curse, I guess. Altered to trog. Okay, this all looks like we've mapped it out before, so should go someplace new. We should eat some of our, like, six bed rations while we're going there. <laughs> I have my volume setting a little bit lower this time, so hopefully if the hamsters make noise it won't pick up like it did last time. But it is straining my voice a little bit to speak a bit louder. So if I'm a bit quieter than you used to, that's why. Hopefully you can still hear me. You might have to raise the volume on the video or on your own. An arrow and an orcish flail. Okay. But yeah, you might have to raise the volume on your computers more than you normally do. So sorry if that's the case. Bald. Scroll of teleportation. Ooh, explodey darts. I like explodey darts. Uh, crimson amp. Please die. I know they regenerate pretty quickly, which is why I'm trying to be really aggressive. Good. And Shining One is happy about that for some reason. Do we have any abilities? No, just renounce religion, which I don't want to do right now. Uh, giant eyeball. Let's butcher you. Two chunks of eyeball flesh. I don't think eyeballs work that way, but whatever. I can eat it, right? You an ogre. Can I hit you? Hmm. Well, Shining One doesn't like when we throw stuff at netted opponents, which is kind of annoying. Let's see what we have. Oh, Explodey Darts. Could quiver those. Ice based, but we should be able to beat this ogre now. Level 8. Cool. Ooh. Okay, that thing hit pretty hard. Please leave me alone. I'm gonna back myself into a corner, I think. Nope, it worked out. Cool. Wow, this thing's fucking tough. What does the description say about it? Terrible creature formed of snow and crystalline ice. Its feet leave puddles of icy water on the floor. Looks dangerous, susceptible to fire, resistant to enchantments, large. Okay. So. I have a dart of flame. That should help, right? It appears unharmed, so no, that didn't help at all. Fuck. Please leave me alone. Stop following me. Yeah, I don't think fighting this is going to go well for me, so let's try to lose it in the corridors.
Mm, looks like we're close to finishing the map here anyway. It might have lost us. So, let's... Oh, what? Arrow of Dispersal. Arrow of Dispersal. Hey, there's that Ice Beast again. Oh. Goodbye, buddy. That's a corner. I knew that was a corner from last time I tried to run away up there. Don't know why I went back there. Just not very good at life, apparently. Crimson Imp I can handle. Yeah, cool. And it makes the Shining one happy. Okay. So, here's more of the map we hadn't explored yet. I think we should get out of here, though, before that Ice Beast finds us again. Shit. Saw us just as we were going down the stairs, really? Uh, what items do we have? Uh, we have two potions of curing, which will come in handy. Uh, let's use that while we're in this corner. Hmm. I think I want to try out that green potion too. Potion of Brilliance. That doesn't help us at all. Uh, the Orc Priest invokes the aid of Bayog against me? What? Okay, yeah, we're running away. Water moccasin is really fucking fast. Uh, cloth curing. Uh, hmm. I guess I'll. Okay, push with might kind of helps, I think. <sighs> okay, curing it is. What are the odds that purple potion will heal me? Pretty bad, I think. Worth a try. Did not work out. Okay, running away again. So many like dead little corners here. Losing my buoyancy isn't that bad. What is dropping all this stuff? I don't get it. Apparently whatever it is is invisible, which is not good for me. I'm dead. What the fuck was that? <sighs> Apparently I had a Necronomicon. Fuck. Okay, well, we just got dropped into like the mill of a fucking mess there, apparently. Uh, I don't know what I want to be now. I didn't remember to check my time before I started, so I have no idea how long we survived even. Um, I think we tried Feelud before and that went about as well as expected. Let's be an ogre. Berserkers believe in Trog, the magic hating god of frenzy. Not much can stop a raging berserker early on, apart from hubris. Sure, let's try that. The spear. Trog says kill them all. Okay, well, I'll work on that. Couldn't hurt, right? Actually, it almost certainly could hurt. And yeah, ogres, I think, are usually pretty good about eating flesh. They don't mind it so much, which is creepy, but useful. 
very useful because it means we're a lot less likely to get hungry. Yeah, none of these are really playing it much of a fight. Uh, I do have abilities though. I can burn spell books, go berserk, or renounce my religion. Hmm. I'll butcher and eat some chunks. No, I'm not hungry enough to eat that yet. Other armor. I don't think I can wear most armor because ogres are pretty, like, big and most armor is roughly human sized. Which I am not. But yeah, it looks like. This first floor won't be too problematical unless I do something stupid like that. Let's go berserk. Okay. So yeah, going berserk when it wears off, I guess you get slowed down like that and exhausted. Can I pray over bodies? I can. Neat. Yes, I'll eat rotting flesh chunk things. Ooh, poison needles. If we can get a blow dart, that's actually really handy. Uh, I don't think we need more strength, but I'll get it. Oh, that's why I forgot my fucking skills. Okay, uh, fight go away. Dodging I'll keep because I can't wear much armor. Actually, I'll focus dodging for right now because I can't wear much armor. back here. Stop that. Didn't mean to hit L, meant to hit P, which is the button you use to pray over corpses like that, yeah. A spear, I think I already have one of those, but I'll pick it up in case it's enchanted or something. Um... You can now regenerate and be protected from hostile enchantments. Trog's hand, cool. Cost piety though, but could come in handy if I remember that I have it. I think ogres get hungry pretty quickly. It seems that way anyway. That might be a problem. Um. This first floor isn't proving too difficult as an ogre, though, which is nice. Come here, I want to eat you. Thank you. Oh, I, wasn't, I didn't even leave a body. What an asshole. Just wanted to eat your bat flesh. Can't even do that. Rude. Yeah, we definitely get hungry faster than the other characters did. Stop disappearing, I need your bodies to eat them. Ooh, ring. Ruined ring. I don't know what it does, but it's a ring. Glowing hand axe. Hmm. I kinda wanna take that, but I don't think we can actually use hand axes very effectively. Fine, I'll eat a ration since none of these bats are nice enough to drop me food. Still nothing. What the hell? Okay, well, we're done exploring at least. Finally. 
not quite hungry enough for that. So I think it's trolls that I was thinking of that'll eat flesh anytime. Not ogres, which is kind of annoying really. I like trolls too. I've played a troll of some sort or another before. And it was actually pretty fun. I think they regenerate a little bit faster than most. Never played as an ogre before. So I think their thing is just that they're big and really, really strong. So I have a lot of potions. Cool. First guess. That worked out better than I expected. Trog, stop taking my fucking kills. I need to eat some of them. Although right now I'm not hungry, so whatever. But I need at least some of them around so I can eat. Is there anything on the other side of this? No. Quaka. Fine, Trog can have that one. I'm not too hungry yet. Dart. Why did that bat heal? Or did I kill one and another one was just like right behind it? Come here. Cool, leveled up. Put your one and pay over the rest. I was pretty happy with this at least, that's nice. I don't know how long until we actually get like a new ability from Trog. I've never had past the first one, so I don't really know much about what it does. Oh yeah, when I was watching the video back, apparently that super speed looks really kind of awkward in recording. That's because of how quickly it's moving, but like when I do it, it looks like smooth. I can see every step along the way, but when I watch it back in recording, it looks like it's just skipping every like couple steps. It's just teleporting a couple tiles at a time. So I should probably stop using it, but I, know, I kind of want to finish this floor and end the episode because I have a headache. And I'm kind of tired of doing the first two floors or whatever over and over again. Like, we've seen this before. 15 poison needles. I will take those. Uh, I think we're almost next going here. Ooh, worm. Please die. Thank you. No, it didn't even give us our body. Okay, we're done exploring here. So I'm gonna read some of these. Hmm, nothing happened. Identify something. Let's identify this ring. Ring of Sea Invisible. Good to have. Uh, let's identify our other spear. Waste of time. Um, let's try those four. Yeah, okay. Remove curse. I can identify another thing. Let's try. Oh, teleportation. Okay. What's I? Enchant weapon. Okay, is noise. Happy I did this on an empty floor. Um. Uh. Unknown. I unknown. Brilliance. Paralysis. Let's eat that apple. Speed. Might. 
and I don't know. What happened to my spear though? I'm not sure. That was kind of odd. Yeah, all of our buffs wore out. That's fine. That's why I know what they did. F. Okay. Well, let's go to the next floor and I'll cut the episode there. Wrong button. Okay. So it looks like we're in a pretty safe, empty room. It's a nice place to end it. I've been recording for like 30 minutes. It's not bad. See you next time, guys. Bye.